So the dragon actually takes interest in the group of hippies called the Morning Light. Hmm. Alright, well he had one more mission for us, so I guess we'll go and take a look at that one. Our intrepid fucking hero. Pretty impressive stunt you pulled out there. I got my good eye on you. Hey, hey, Cassie. This is the one. Hey there, hot stuff. I like your style. And your weapon. Cassandra is our resident Mary Magdalene. Don't let those doe eyes fool you. She'll eat you up. I do have a big appetite. Comes with being southern, I guess. Not that Jesus here would notice. He's immune to my female charms. Boy's got no spunk. Anyway, Che, I need to talk to you. There's an issue with, uh, you know. Who's doing the pickup? I am. And who else? I'm going solo. I can handle myself just as well as- Not gonna happen, babe. You could get your pretty little ass hurt bad out there. Your concern is heartwarming, Jay. I'm sure it's got nothing to do with wanting to keep an eye on me. Trust issues. Hey, feel like doing us a favor? Call it your ticket to a new Jerusalem. When we finish building it. <sighs> if that's the kind of company you're talking about, well then... I might be... flexible. Very, very flexible. She's talking about sexual positions. That's what that little pause was. It's her idea of subtlety. Fuck off. We could get to know each other better. I'd like to find out what lies beneath those still waters. Oh, and don't worry. It's not far. And we won't do anything you don't want to do. Okay with you? Jesus. Alright, well, I guess we're heading with her to go in to maintenance yeah. tunnels and escort. We're with the you've seen the flyers, you've seen our commercials, you've probably even talked to some of our good people. Can't escape the light, my friend. It's all fucking encompassing. Like air. We're like air. Breathe it. We were, you know, just passing through with our little band of merry fucking hippies. When that shit rolled in from the sea. Like whipped cream on a blueberry pie. Beaumont's got a direct line with Marcard himself. Knows him personally. That's like knowing someone who knew Jesus, you know? A red telephone to our motherfucking savior. So, you guys, you run around like you're young gods. Like you rule the fucking planet. I gotta say, I thought I was arrogant back in the day, but I was nothing. Nothing compared with you people. You take arrogance to a whole new level. Okay, so he's apparently not a fan of the other secret societies. Hasta la vista, amigo. I see a bit of lore. I don't know why there's just a random thing of gasoline here. this. Okay, it's very hard, so I don't want to do it right now. Let's go ahead and start up this mission. This looks like to be the same tunnel yeah, it is the same tunnel. There was a door here? I don't remember there being a door here. 
solo instance. So it's basically a solo dungeon. What the fuck happened here? Somebody's been tampering with the security. We need to be careful. Lucky thing I have you here. Maybe I'll get to see you. Flex your muscles. Huh. Okay, somebody's dead on the ground here. What else is going on here? I don't see anybody. I assume there must be monsters around or something. Here's some lasers. What's going on over Careful. here? Motion sensors. Yeah, he's paranoid. He really treasures his privacy. Um. <laughs> I can't believe that just happened. <laughs> I didn't expect it to explode like that, seriously. I thought maybe it would call like some enemies or something. I didn't expect the whole room to explode. Okay, what do I do here? Can I like sneak past it? I'm assuming like the... Okay. Oh, shoot. It stopped, I think. Yeah, it did. So if I get far enough away from it, it won't explode on me. Can I, like, just run through it, maybe? Yeah, I need to actually start running before I get too close to it. I don't even have to be close to that light for it to go off. That's the wrong direction, I think. Okay, so yeah, I have to go this way. Alright. Yeah, I can't even get close to it without setting it off. Okay, let's run through it. Yeah, yeah, that actually worked. So it does actually take a while for it to actually go off. Shit. Keep your head down. I don't recognize those outfits. Fuck's sake, who wears purple to a death match? No sense of fashion whatsoever. Huh. There's a box over there somewhere. I've seen B use it. Controls the laser grids. If we could get that reactivated. Well, let's see. Green light goes on there. That turns off. Middle one turns on. That one turns on. So do I get... I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing here. Whoa! Oh, they're all dead. <laughs> Yes, deactivated. Hold on. I remember B telling me this place connects to the sewers. With the security on the fritz, you know, eyes open. Are you kidding me? I have to choose a door. And of course there's probably a monster behind most of these. Shoot. No. Dang, this thing has some HP. Only good thing is that it can't really hit that hard. Don't run away from me. Okay. 
Okay, it's dead. Okay, there's nothing in here, so I guess this was the wrong room. I don't think it's the middle one. I think it's probably the one to the right. I, I can't imagine it being the middle. It's too obvious. Are you kidding me? Well, never mind. I'm a moron. Unless they all have monsters in them. Yeah, he has a little bit more damage to him. But I still out damage him. Not this one either. So it's obviously the middle one. Unless I'm missing something big. Although the worst that can happen is that I fight another monster. Nope, that was the right room. I can't believe it. It's like the game knew I wouldn't pick the middle one because I thought it would be too obvious. Another one of these little countermeasures. Keeps the drag out. They don't like being zapped. Are you Careful. kidding me? Electrified floor. How could you even do this with lag? I'm so glad I don't have lag. Or any like sort of freezing or anything like that. I can't even imagine trying to do this. I don't even know if this would like one instant KO me or something. I don't even want to know. I see some of them turning on and off. So my worst fear right now is to have one like turn on right underneath me at some point. I think it was like right around here that was turning on and off. Okay. It's like I'm in a sequel to Saul or something in here. Where's the clown with his on the TV? I still haven't gotten that game on Steam. I need to get it. This wasn't here the last time, I swear. B has got some serious trust issues. Think you can figure it out? Um, let me see the switches first. Uh, okay, what do they do? Okay, I guess I have to get all three of them lit up. It shouldn't be that hard. Okay, that one turns that one off. I'm assuming the middle one would be the hardest one to have on with all of them. Okay. Maybe this one over here? I haven't seen what it does yet. Okay, there was one over here that turned that one on. Perfect. Okay, so here's the deal. I'm gonna let it go. It's better for everyone if this package doesn't end up with those fucking morning light hippies. We're a different breed, you and I. We're better than they are. So let me take this with me and go through that door, and I will owe you a favor. A big one. Do we have a deal? Um... I have to go. Are you kidding me? Believe me. I hate this as much as you do. We'll see each other again. When the both of us have... It's this way. <laughs> I don't think that was meant to happen. Take care, okay? When I'm ready for you, you'll know where to find me. Ugh. How long is this stun gonna last? There we go. Well, she took off fast, didn't she? Ah, uh, this is where I must get out. I need to make sure I step... Don't step right into the lasers like a moron. There we go. Back to King's Myth. Hmm.
Alright, I wonder what to do now. Authority. Damage, of course. Uh, I don't know what I would do now. Uh, I could go to that skateboard place. Man, I don't feel like fighting right now. the heck is that a player or I don't think that's a player although it has the same sort of naming like a player it's odd okay Maybe we'll go visit the sheriff again, because I'm pretty sure that there's a bunch of missions there that I did not complete. I wonder if I could use this to make talismans. Wait, what's this place up ahead? I don't think I've ever been here before. No, I haven't. Oh, this is a shop. Oh, huh. Hmm. I don't really particularly need anything at the moment, though. I could sell some stuff. I don't really want to... Well, I could sell the stuff that I don't really need. Like the stuff that I know I don't need, like the belt. Fist weapon I'll keep a hold of. Repair? Oh, of course I won't repair it all. Okay. Well, beyond that... Hammer. I don't need a hammer. Is there some way I can use this stuff to make a talisman? <laughs> oh, yeah, it has to go in the tool slot. Never mind. Um... That work? Apparently not. Well, I can actually disassemble stuff. That's kind of neat. Where did everything go? Okay... Never mind that. What the heck? What was that shaking? There's another helicopter going by. I don't know where those are coming from and where they're going, but I just keep on seeing one in the sky sometimes. And here's the sheriff's office. Uh, hello, zombies. That's odd. That was weird. It wasn't showing the um, shotgun blast you were making the noise for a second there. I don't know if I lost connection or something? I don't know. Well, 
Let's see what this guy's up to. Hello, my friend. Back in my old life, I always wondered what was around the corner I didn't take. Down the road I didn't go. That's how I ended up here. Up to my elbows in machine grease rigging bombs. <laughs> Relax, my friend. I got plenty of experience blowing shit up. I got a handle on death and the instruments thereof. And no desire to see the infinite darkness claim any of us quite yet. These mechanical servants of the Reaper will stay still and silent. Till I'm good and ready to push that button. Traveling the big countries taught me everything from bull riding to bonsai. Enough to cause a man to lose his appetite for destruction. But circumstances require us to yield to the greater good. Even when that greater good isn't all that pretty. Road here said I'd be pitching in with soft-shell lobster season. Instead, I found nightmare country. Maybe the very rotten heartland of it. But I'm philosophizing. Life is sacred. Every moment is precious. Which brings us right back around to blowing up dead guys. I've got no shortage of time or ideas. What I'm lacking is the nuts and bolts of it. I could fill a shopping cart down Main Street, but getting out there and back, that's what's kicking my ass, my friend. All right, well, apparently he wants us to go get some stuff from a shopping list. There's his handy with his hands, but he's only got two of them to help him take apart a broken shotgun and use its parts to make something powerful and new. I could do that. I'll be seeing you later, friend. Okay, I just saw how to disassemble something a second ago. Shotgun kinda looks like a Tetris piece to be honest. Like one of those weird uh Tetris pieces that look like that. Okay. Oh wait, there we go. Perfect. Now let's switch this out with the weapon kit. Where is the... Oh, okay. I was wondering where it went. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Never mind. I forgot that I disassembled it already. Wow, I'm an idiot. Uh, let's see here. I guess having more metal is not ac actually a bad idea, though. Okay, it was like three on the bottom, I believe. Or was it two? Hang on. Was this it? Yeah, it was three on the bottom. Perfect. This actually might be more powerful. Okay, that one's locked, so we can't do it yet. Let's see. That thing has more weapon power. Almost 25 more. Does it look any different than the other shotgun? Can't see it. It's in my hands.
I can't even read that. That's too small. <laughs> okay, go to the gas station. Alright, I do think that looks a little different. Is it any more powerful though? I could test it on those zombies, but... Okay, what do I need at the gas station? Collect propane tank. Okay, here it is. That's dangerously close to a fire, as usual. I always have, have to have propane tanks next to a fire. Okay, now we're getting towards the shore with all the more dangerous enemies. I don't know which one we're actually heading towards because it has two different places that we can go to. Why is it just sitting here? I can't pick it up. Whatever. Okay. I th this is the park, I guess. Alright. Okay, I've killed a hundred zombies already. Wonderful. Okay, now we have to go to a bed and breakfast. That is over 200 meters away. <laughs> Trying not to get the attention of enemies. I think I got one of one their attention because the music just started. As long as I keep ahead of them though, I think I'll be fine. Alright, we discovered the bed and breakfast. And there is a suicide note on the door. A note is pinned to the door. It reads, I lost my husband of only a week to the fog. He followed the calls and walked into the sea like so many others. Why I was spared, I don't know, but living without him now. And I just found him as a punishment worse than death. I will go after him. Uh, I don't think I'm going to do that one right now. Hmm. That's a bunch of weird stuff. Unfortunately, it's like right next to an enemy. No. Holy crap. They're everywhere. I can't even... Are you kidding me? There's just a wave of them. Let me grab this, please, and just go. Let me have the chance, please. Come on, come on. There we go. Wonderful. I need to get to the fire department. I need to run. I need to run now. I'm gonna die. Are they shooting beams at me, or what? 